Good morning, everybody. 6.30 in the morning here, just chilling on the porch like we always do, drinking our coffee, catching up on the news. You know, the usual, just enjoying the, the brisk 36-degree weather out here. We have got work to do over the construction site. First, we, uh, we got a, just one more load of dirt that we got to haul back. And then we, uh, we actually are going to be working on our first contract, our first construction site. It's here in town, and, uh, yeah, well, I'll explain what it is, uh, later on, but today we're going to be chiseling up the old concrete, we're gonna be shoveling it all out of there, bucking, you know, with buckets and everything, and, uh, we're going to hopefully start trying to level out the dirt and the ground and everything, to prepare for a repour of concrete to get the foundation in place for what we are building there. But we're not gonna get that far today. All we're gonna get is probably it chiseled up and uh, we'll probably will start on, uh, on on flattening out the uh, the ground as well. Would be my guess is the farthest that we'll get today. We'll see what happens here. First things first, gotta roll up this morning and unlock the front gate and get to work now. Our yard is a bit of a mess here. And if I'm not careful, if I don't keep on top of this, it's gonna stay a mess. So. Before we do anything this morning, before we go and we get that load of dirt and, and anything else, we're going to do just a little bit of cleanup. It's just a little bit of a mess out here. So I'm going to come over here and back up to this big text trailer. We're going to get this thing parked out of the way for now, at least so it's out of the way. There we go. Let's, uh, where do I want to put this? I'm thinking... Um... You know what? I think you can go right over there. I see a nice spot where this might be able to just slot right on in for now. We have the bucket and the other uh, attachment for pulling trailers for the skid loader on here at the moment. Oh, come on. Can we get just a little farther? There we go. So we uh, we don't want to put this away away yet because I need to get that stuff off of there. We'll get it off all in good time. Also, that dump truck right there is the one that we're going to be firing up today so I probably should get it warmed up and good to go because it is 36. No, it's not freezing out. It's not really all that cold but probably should let it warm up just a little bit before we take it down the road. Let's get right past that piece of wood. There we go. And right up next to that fence. You know what? We're going to call that good. Disconnect. Pull the truck on out of there. Now this truck we can park back here like we always do. Let me Try and turn this thing around. Don't think, yeah, that only, the only other thing we need to move really is that truck over there. So let me pull this off right up over here. There we go. She's sinking down into the gravel like last time. Jeez. Uh, we're going to get this fired up and ready to go. Might as well. All right, let's turn her over. Okay, yeah, cool. I didn't know if it was going to start, but it did just fine. We get the lights all on. We got the, uh, the heater blasting already to get it warmed up in here just a little bit. It's really not that cold. It's actually fairly nice out. 36 is pretty warm, but we just want to make sure everything's warmed up and ready to go this morning. Let's run over here and we're going to move this Ford and this uh, PJ trailer on out of the way because it's kind of like out here in the middle and it's just in a bad spot. So we're going to get this moved over just probably one slot at least or or something. I don't know. Maybe I can put this somewhere else. We'll... we'll for now, we'll just slot it over another position here. As always, guys, if you enjoy the video, make sure you hit the like button. And if you find yourself watching more than one video, go ahead and click that subscribe button because there's a good chance that you enjoy the content and you want to be notified when new ones are posted. I appreciate you guys for that. Thank you. But we're backing this thing up. Get this all the way up next to this kind of fence line almost. It's all the way out of the way. That should do. Cut it off. There we go. We have so much more room here now. That's so much better. So, oh, oh yeah, I, I forgot I got the uh, the skin loader over here because we picked this thing up. That was cool. I forgot about that. So we're going to hop into the uh, dirt, the uh, dump truck. We're going to head down there and get a couple loads of dirt. Or just a load of dirt, I should say. A couple, buck couple bucketfuls is all it should be. And then we're going to get working on uh, what we actually have to work on today. We may end up having to haul some dirt out of that out of the place we're working at today too i don't know depends on how far we get i don't know how much is going to be access and how much we're gonna have to pull off or fill in and whatnot we got to level out the ground a bit there before we 
do anything. But before we do that, we got to chisel up all the uh, all the concrete that's already there. So we got a bit of work to do ahead of us. Also, I just want to say all these single player videos, every single one um, starting like this week almost or well, I don't know when you're watching this. So just imagine all, every one of these single player videos are probably pre-recorded. OK, just want to make sure that's clear that all these are pre-recorded both on the River Valley Restorations and on this construction series. It's just so I can handle it myself and it gives me more time to make them and edit them and everything myself uh, with that. At the time of recording this, at least, now, I don't know, maybe they've been released since then, but at the time of recording this, River Valley Restorations has been on a hold. It's been backed up, and uh, we got a backlog built up of them. Uh, and it's partially because I wanted to build up a backlog, but let me just put it this way. A video was supposed to re release on, like, the 18th, and uh, long story short, I can't get into specifics. Maybe you guys have seen it by now. Maybe it still hasn't been approved. I don't know, but the video, that video has a sponsor, okay? Or at least had a sponsor, whether or not it still does. I might cut it out. I might just cut the ad out and then give you guys the video because I'm getting a little annoyed that they haven't reviewed the video and approved it to be posted. They're like three days behind on approving this video at the time of recording this, that is. So, um, yeah, that's why RVR is on hold, because I can't post the other ones until I post that one. Otherwise, things won't make sense. And I haven't gotten permission to post that one, at least at the time of recording this, like I said. But I don't know. Maybe by the time you see this video, that's all been sorted out. I don't know. If not, and if you actually and if you end up watching some RVR stuff and you don't notice an advertisement in it because I got fed up and I, I cut it out of the video, <laughs> I guess we'll see how things go. But as of right now, no RVR. Anyways, we're just about down here, so we're going to get down here. Load up with some dirt, take it back up to our place. We're also going to load up the uh, k b 250, the wheel loader, take it back up to our place as well, so it's not sitting down here anymore, and we are going to get to work today. All right, we're pulling in here. Let's just park this thing up. I think right here should be fine. That should do. Turn the lights on a little bit more. We'll leave this running as well. Top out. Our tarp is all off and everything looking good. Perfect. We're ready to roll. We don't have much. We got, you know, some straggling, straggler bits here or whatnot. Um, really, I just want to get kind of this pile right here. It's really not that much. It's like a, we have already, a, we already have a bucket, by the way. Full. Well, that's like another bucket, bucket and a half, two buckets, maybe. So not too terribly much. Let's get this old thing fired up. You guys know how it is. Got to pump the gas. Come on. Come on. Come on. I'm pumping it. Come on. Seriously? Any day now. It might not start this morning. Oh, oh, there we go. There we go. I was thinking maybe it's a little too cold for it to start this morning. Maybe it wasn't going to be working for us. Maybe it's a union worker and it was like, nah, dude, too early. <laughs> I don't know. It started, though. Let's lift this thing up. There we go. And we'll, uh, we'll start loading up here. Let's actually turn on them lights so we can kind of see what we're doing. We'll turn them all on. How's that? We're not even, we don't even have them all on. Now we got all of them on. Or now we got all of them on. Woo, this thing's got like a Christmas tree. There's so many lights on it. All right, right over here. Lift her up. It's easy. We're learning how to use this from last time. Soon we'll become a pro at it. We're not there yet, but we will be. There we go. Get that filled up. And that's a bucket. Uh, back her up. Drop it down. And turn yourself around. That's what it's all about. <laughs> you put your bucket down. You go to town. You pick up the dirt and you, I don't know, something else. Man, come on. We're getting stuck in the mud. There we go. It was getting a little sketchy. It was not want to pick that stuff up. Kind of drag along the ground, getting stuck in the mud a little bit. Must be kind of wet out this morning. Okay, you okay back? Stop backing up now into the brush, boy. Holy cow. I'm not the best at driving this thing yet. We're getting the hang of it. I want to get to where I'm an absolute pro at it, though, because I love driving this thing. No, that's too close, Jake. I can already tell. There we go. We got that dumping in. Not too much longer. There we go. Back her up. Ah, dang it. Almost run into it again. There we go. Let's turn around again. Just a couple more bucket loads. Maybe just one more even. 
Not that much. Not that much left here. Let's see if we can pick this stuff up. There we go. And let's just try sliding over here and getting this a little bit. You know what? We're going to call that good. I think we, we got the well majority of all the dirt over here. We don't need, uh, I mean, we always need more, but we'll get more at another date. We got enough for now, and that's what matters. All right. Dump that on in. There we go. And, geez, that is a pretty decent load right there, isn't it? No, eh, not really. I thought it was more than that. All right. Let's put this thing on the trailer. Stop. There you go. Gotta learn to hit the brakes, Jake. That's how you get things to stop. Surprise, surprise. Try loading this thing up now. Now, somebody told me that I can actually angle the, the back end of this trailer down. And I had not tried that before. So real quick, before we even try putting this on, let's run over here and fire up the old truck here. Kenworth. There we go. Turn on the lights. And they lied to me. Yep. They lied to me. This one does not fold. This one does not angle down or anything. Maybe they were talking about a different thing. I don't know. Either way, we're going to pull this thing up onto here. There you go. It kind of lined up poorly. And let's just use this bucket to pull me on up on top of that. Perfect. And straight forward we go. Come on now. There you go. Sometimes it doesn't want to climb it, but we got it. Back her up a little bit. A little bit more, a little bit more, a little bit more. Just room to set this bucket down. And... Perfect. Shut everything off here. Shut you off. Actually, you know what? Yeah, we'll shut you off. But I think... Mm, do I drive this or do I drive the dump truck back? Who do I drive back? Um, you know what? I'll tell, uh, we brought, we brought Tim with us. I'll tell old Tim to just drive the dump truck back for me. Actually, yeah, we'll tell him to drive the dump back truck back for me. I think that'll just make life easier. We'll, uh, we'll get Tim lined up here and then we'll hit the road. Actually, I'm going to have to turn this thing all up. Well, we'll figure it out. It'll work out. All right, Tim's in the dump truck. Let's get into Kenworth, and let's roll on out of here. Take a turn nice and wide, apparently. Holy cow. Turn now. There you go. Looks like Tim's coming along just fine, and it's muddy out here. Ooh! Ooh! Don't get stuck now! Uh-oh. Oh, this is going to cause a problem. Hey, Tim! Give me a shove! Tim! You gotta be kidding me. Got stuck in the mud. We'll put this other axle down, see if that'll help. No, we are stuck in mud. Gosh dang it. There we go. Oh, come on. Got stuck again. Tim, we're going to have to unload it again and give us another push. Finally. We had to keep unloading the, the old wheel loader and push us along. We kept getting stuck in the mud out here. We're finally rolling. No, no, Tim. Tim! Oh, come on. Now I'm going to get stuck because I'm going to come to a stop again. Now we got to unload it again and go push Tim out. All right, we decided to switch Tim. He's driving the old Kenworth. I'm driving the dumb truck now. Let's, let's get out of here. Let's roll. Let's finally hit the road. Is he going to get stuck? Oh, buddy, you got to watch your tree! What are you doing? Oh my god, why did I ever hire you? You're such an idiot. All right, we got Tim unstuck. What a dumb dumb. Follow me properly this time, Timmy boy. Let's hope he doesn't do something stupid back there. All right, well, we're convoying. We're headed back up to the yard. He's falling in behind. Slowly but surely, he'll be here. So... We're going to head up to the yard and uh, get this stuff unloaded and finally get to work on what we were planning on doing today. Man, this mud is so deep through here. I'm going to be glad we're not going to have to come through here for another little while. Look at him. Can he climb up out of there? Yeah! That's what I like to see. Perfect. Slow down, Tim! Slow down, Tim! 
Get off of my butt, Tim! Oh, Tim. Look what you've done. You done decapitated yourself with the load. Seriously, Tim. 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 Back off. Tim! Tim, you idiot. Did you not strap the load down? Tim! Watch yourself, boy! Oh, Tim. Look what you did to my truck! I can't believe it. Would you not strap this thing down properly? Good lord. Hard to find good help, man. Hard to find good help. Don't ride my butt this time, Tim. Slow down, Tim. Slow down, Tim. Slow down, Tim. Tim! Ah, Tim. God dang it. I swear. I'm gonna... Oh, you took out the... Stop! No, stop! Stop driving, Tim! What are you doing? <laughs> God dang it. Get off the road. No, Tim, watch out! There's cars come. Yeah, it's all right. Come all the way out here. That'll work. We'll make this work. Oh, this is a nightmare. Come on, buddy. This way. This way. Oh, the trail. The, oh, the, oh, my God. Tim. 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 Tim, stop. Stop. Tim, stop. Stop. Let me fix your load. Stop. Where are you going? Where are you headed? Where are you going? What are you? Tim. 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 Do you know how to drive? Look what you did to the load again. This is why we can't have nice things, Tim. It's okay, Tim. Papa Pickle fixed your load again, but let's take it nice and easy this time. Maybe don't ride my butt and slam the brakes. What do you say? Come on. There you go. Make your make the widest turn I've ever seen in my life. There you go. Come on. You got the wrong blinker on. Oh, it's because I got my blinker on. Come on. No, Tim. Tim, that's a, Tim. Tim, that's a pole. That's a pole. No, you're not. Stop telling me you're blocked by an object, you stupid idiot! Alright, so I decided Tim is too stupid to ever drive something with a trailer, so now he only ever gets to drive the dump truck. Tim never gets to drive anything else ever, period. Only the dump truck. That's it. Finally, we can get to the yard and start our day. Oh my gosh, Tim. Tim, brakes. Learn where they are, buddy. No train coming, no train coming. Perfect. And our turn is... Oh, that's a neat skid loader. Our turn is right here. All right, Tim. Look, I indicated you know we're turning. This is where the yard is. You know where we are, buddy, right? Nice and easy with me here. Watch. Let's take this turn. Nice and easy. Yeah, there you go. Who's a good Tim? See, you can drive the dump truck, but nothing else ever. Okay, please stop now. All right, Tim, you're fired. I'm taking over. Okay, first, let's go and put this dirt away, shall we? Oh, it has been an endeavor, and we haven't even gotten to the main course, the main point of this video yet. Yikes, I feel like we've ran a marathon so far. Now, we gotta dump this in here and probably get stuck doing so, so I'm excited for that. Oh, yay. This action cannot be performed. That's always what I wanted to hear. You break it, Tim? What'd you do? All right, finally, we got it all dumped out. Oh, it's, uh, it's been a long day and it's only 6.57 in the morning. Woo! I am gonna need some advil headache relief today that's for sure what am i gonna need what do i need to take over there need the um i'm gonna need the kubota and that i'm just gonna need the kubota and some hand tools really i suppose let me just double check at least today we'll take frank's ride here meow we're gonna take this we're gonna hook up to that big tex we're gonna take the kubota and that is what we're gonna take over there to work on today it's not a massive job at least today, but <laughs> we'll see. You know, I thought I thought getting dirt would be simple. Boy, was I proved wrong. All right, we got that all connected up. Let's pull it on out of there, nice and easy, perfect. And I, yeah, I'm gonna need the uh, bucket. So we're gonna have to take this other stuff off of here. Uh, actually, you know what? Hold up. Since I'm probably gonna wanna move this again or something at some point, I'm gonna drop these forks right here. Perfect. There we go. So we'll leave those there. Now, let's get this bucket. So I think I'm gonna have to try and turn that bucket around. You think I'm strong enough to do it? Man, Tim, I paid you 180 bucks to wreck my vehicle. That's not cool. All right, let's see. First, I'm gonna pull this thing out of the way. So nice and easy. There we go. Now I gotta spin this. So here, we'll grab here. Just give it a little tug. Come on. 
Oh. Okay, now over here. Oh, slide it. Whew. Okay, one, two, three. Just one more. Here we go. One, two, three. There we go. Whew. Needle. I need a, uh, a cookie after that. All right, lift this thing up. Pull forward a bit. Get it up underneath there and lock it up. There we go. And lift it up. Perfect. Back up. Drop this down. Easy, though. There we go. Drop it down. Fold it out. We'll, uh, we'll hop out. Make sure those are kicked, locked in place. There we go. And there we go. Get the hydraulics all in. Perfect. Load it up onto the trailer here. Oh, we're going to have to put them ramps down. All right. All right. We got the ramps down. Let's hop back in the Kubota. That up. There we go. All right. Just right over here. And turn sharp. Can't see where I'm going. Oh, there we are. Okay. I'm going to lift this up so I can see my wheels line up here at least. We're going to lift that back down so we're not top heavy. Just right on up it. Perfect. I'll leave with the weight right here. Angle that bucket down. That'll do. Shut it off. Strap it in place. Strap you in place as well. Actually, you know what? I don't need you. I don't need you to come with me right now. So what I'll do is... Uh, this one's not as heavy. Here we go. Straight over here. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, I'll call it. That's good. We'll have to turn it around when we want to get it next. All right. Now we can hit the road. Let's take this on over to the construction site. We'll get all that unloaded another time. Unless I'm going to need it today, but I really don't think I'm going to. So we're going to roll in the old dump truck 550 meow truck. We're going to head on over to this uh, site, which is just down the road here, not too far. I didn't have my ramps down. I don't know what you're talking about. We're going to head down the road here. It's not too far. Just uh, one more stop sign after this, I think, or so. You can kind of see where we're headed. So a business is wanting to expand their uh, their lot here a bit. They want to put up another shed. And that is what we're going to be doing for them. But first, got to get all the old concrete out of there. Got to tear it up. Got to level it out. Got to pour the new concrete. Got a lot of stuff to do before we can even start building the shed here. Oh, right up here. Anybody coming? Doesn't look like it. They got a nice basketball court there in the park right here. This would be a great place for a house in all reality. I'd love to see someone build a house here. But I think, um, well, yeah, here. Trying to get this dump truck and everything uh, stay out of the way. Let me see if I can pull it off just up here. Oh, come on. I wanted to angle it in case I just wanted to pull on out of here. Really? All right. All right. Let's try backing it up. Let's see if we can get it out of the way back here. I think we should be able to. Oh, well. I guess we're going to have to... We're going to get it mostly out of the way. It'll be a little bit in the way. We'll just have to move it another day. Well, there is no good place to put this thing, so it's out of the way, is there? You know what? You know what? We're going to pull it uh, just right up off over here. I don't think this is going to be too much of a big deal. I think they should be fine with it. Pull this right up over here, just right up along the park. Get away from that stop sign a bit. That should be fine right there. Put the ramps down. Get the old Kubota straps off here. Here we go. Hop up in. Fire it up. Tilt that bucket back. Lift it up. And we'll back this thing right off the trailer. Nice and easy. Nice and easy, he said, while he slides down the trailer. Woo! A little rocky. There we go. Back this right up here. Nobody coming. Let's let everyone know we're backing up. All right. So we got this here. Let that sit for a second. I'm going to bring this truck um, because I want the dump bed. So we're going to drop this trailer somewhere. Okay, I know what we can do. Put them ramps up. 
pull this on around over here. We're just going to drop the trailer. Come on now, truck. You can make that turn. I believe in you. Let's roll through here. A little bit of coming. Nope. And then we'll back the trailer up out of the way right here, I think. Should be fine. Yep, there we go. Put the trailer in reverse. The truck in reverse. And... Perfect. That's out of the way. We'll drop that there. Now we have this truck available to uh, put all the rubble into. We we'll probably should use for as much square footage as this is. Probably should use one of the big trucks. Big dumps. We'll try this one for now. So, let's, uh, let's start working at this here. I know what you're thinking. How are you going to tear all that up with this uh, bucket? But see, if you look at it, it's all chipped away and a lot of it's kind of crumbly gravelly. You can even see the dirt from underneath. Like this, this stuff's in real bad condition. In some areas, we are going to need to chisel it. But in a lot of areas, I think I can just come through with the bucket. Probably get a good bit of it. Uh, but there are sections here, like this section here, where we are going to need to chisel these pieces up. But we'll get it figured out. Let's just get to work. Alright, so what I'm going to do is going to kind of angle that down like that a little bit. And we're just going to kind of go right forward. There you go. And we're going to try and just tear all this stuff up. That's what we're going to try and do. Just go along and tear all this up. Now, I Guys, I know that you would chisel this stuff up, but I don't... There's no chisel in game, so... As far as I know. And if there is, I apologize. You can send it to me on my Discord, by the way. There's a text channel for sending me mods. For those of you who want to see me do stuff, or you know something that would make things better, send it to me. There we go. We got a first pass done. Let's hop... Let's, uh, let's see how that went. Alright. Tilt that back so we can hop out here. Oh, yeah, that worked. So we got it scraped up a little bit, didn't we? A little bit. Not the best. <laughs> this is going to take a while, isn't it? Holy cow. Yikes. Okay, so what we're going to do is I think if I, if I kind of do this, let's head back over that and see if we can scratch away at that a little bit more. Head straight backwards. There we go. Nice and easy. Straight but straight back. Oh, man. I'm getting the hiccups. Oh, gosh. We're losing control here. There we go. There we go. Straight back. And oh, right there. See how we did? Oh, yeah. We got a little bit more of that. Look at that. There we go. See, this is working out. Working out all right. Sweet. Well, let's get at it. Let's keep it up and see how much of this we can get done this morning. All right, let's tilt that bucket back. There we go. Oh, ah, shoot. I hit that. There you go, Jake. How much damage did you do? <laughs> smooth one, smooth one. All right, well, we've made some progress so far. Let's hop out and take a look at it here. As you can see, we've got this little section done yet. We've been bucking it all in the back of that. That's getting near full. Probably should take that to dump here soon. But not, I mean, we got a lot to go yet. We were like a fourth of the way done here. I think I'm going to try and get this half done. Uh, but before we continue that, we got to go dump this load here. So let me shut this off. Let's hop in the old mail truck. Fire it up. There we go. Oh, the mail truck. Let's fire it up. There's a song right there. We're going to run this over to, man, I wish I had a facility, a location for just discarding materials uh, for recycle and waste and stuff. That will be something useful down the road. I think I know a place I could buy. We've actually already been there. I bet you I could buy that place, that little piece of land off of them, real cheap. I don't know. We'll have to, we'll have to reach out to them. I don't know. We'll have to see about that. But Frank says, you know, smart financial decisions first, Jake. <laughs> That's what Frank always says. So let's, uh, we're just gonna have to run over here and dump it in the back back lot of our uh, construction company. That's fine. That's fine. It'll it'll work out. We'll, uh, we'll, we'll pick a place out in the back and we'll just dump it there until we, we take it out elsewise. And right here's our turn. There we go. And you know what? I actually did end up leaving this stuff in the way now, didn't I? Let's skate on through between here. We're going to park this stuff. We're going to dump it right back here, I think. 
Uh, yeah, right down here next to the work truck, the road construction truck would probably be fine. Oh, I should take some of those containers out there and I should put them in those containers. That's what I should do. I should put all the rubble in those things. I need to get those ones dumped. Now that I think about it. All right, let's just back this thing. You know what? I don't like, I don't like this location. This location is too tight and it actually gets used more than you think it would. Let's pick somewhere else to dump this. Um, I think maybe right there could work. Yeah, let's dump it right back in there. Back up. There we go. Right up into there. And there we go. This is what we'll, this is where we're going to dump it. There it goes. There it goes. And almost. Man, that thing goes high up, doesn't it? All right. Drop it down now. There we go. Let me shake it a little bit just to make sure we got it all out of there. A little bit more. Okay. Go ahead and dump that. Or go ahead and bring the bed back down. There we go. And perfect. Got that dump. Let's hit the road. All right. We're at all. We left the lights on on that truck. There we go. We got that dumped there. Perfect. We've got one load unloaded here. One thing dumped. Man, that truck got a little dirty. Going through the mud, didn't it? Holy cow. You know, let's turn them lights off before that battery dies. Don't want that, now do we? All right. Let's head back on over there and, uh, oh, well, okay, cool. And let's, uh, let's get the rest of that half all chiseled up. All right. We're rolling back up here. Let's actually make sure we come to a stop at the stop sign. There we go. Gotta still follow the law, Jake. You might be on the job, but you're on the public roadway. Pull this thing right up over here. That should be fine right there. Stop out. Leave that run. Let's get uh, let's get the rest of this half done. Get another load in there, and uh, I think we'll be good for the day. Start up the Kubota. Perfect. And... I think I was finding that back dragon was working the best here. So we're going to kind of line up a little bit. All right there ought to do fine. Just angle that down, drop it. Perfect. And let's go straight back. Here we go. Nice and easy. Right on back. Having to fight it a little bit. Ooh. Oh, she's getting a little rough in spots. Some parts of this, this stuff doesn't want to break up and other parts do. Got a little bit of water and sitting over here. Let's see if we can pull back close to that. All right. Lift it up, lift it up, lift it up. There you go. And dump it. All right. Perfect. There we go. Let's make sure that's all dumped out. And sweet. So check this out. This is how much we got done. I'm going to go ahead and shut off the Kubota here. So we got about a fourth of the way, maybe half of the way, eh, just about half of the way done here. Some of these bits, a little rough to get on these out, outer pieces, we're going to have to clean that up. But we got the majority of this in here, we had some puddle things going on over here, so I didn't want to touch this quite yet. Try and see if I can get some salt and uh, or something, trying to clean up that standing water and mud and everything there, I don't know. But that's it so far, we got uh, about half of it. All chiseled up. We got the next half to go. Then we got to come out here. We got to do some uh, some uh, leveling to the ground. We got to put rollers on it. Then we got to uh, pour concrete down. Let that set. And then we can start working on the building. But that's it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you have any ideas or suggestions for the construction series, let me know down in the comments below. If you are not subscribed and you uh, enjoy the content, make sure you click that subscribe button. And until next time, I'll see you all later.